Hi, this week's parsha is Parshas Mishpatim. In this week's two-minute discussion, we are going to look at an idea that is often missed at the start of this week's parsha. By way of background, the Jewish people are often referred to as the people of the book. Now, this may be true, we do believe in the five books of Moses, but that is not all. We also believe in a rich tradition, a rich oral tradition that came alongside the written one. For Rav Shemshin Rafal Hirsch, evidence to this oral tradition is at the start of this week's parasha. After God has given the Jewish people the Ten Commandments, after he has told them they are to be his people, God then sets down his law. Now, if this was the primary source of law, what would you expect? You would expect uh, principles of law to be set down, but that is not what we find. We find concrete, unique exceptions set down at the start regarding slavery, regarding poverty, regarding criminality, all at the very beginning. Eile Mishpotim. These are the ordinance, the social ordinances for you as a Jewish nation. Now, without an oral tradition backing up what is being said here, these laws are meaningless. For if you have laws regarding when one man sells another man because of theft or poverty, this doesn't make sense. For how would they know how to go through the process of law, set up a court, deal with evidence, testimony? For Rav Shemshin of Hirsch, this is clear evidence that there must have been an oral tradition that was alive with the Jewish people during the time where the Torah was being recorded. So to recap, for Rav Shemshin of Hirsch, the written law is looked at as notes to a lecture that was given. These notes are useful for those who are in an understanding of the oral tradition. But those who do not know the oral tradition, the notes of a lecture seem bizarre and sporadic. That is the view someone can get by simply perusing the written law. By perusing the written law of Moses, you can be confused. And yes, it is bizarre, but that is because there is an oral law accompanying it that makes it fit together and makes it make sense. Thank you very much for listening and have a wonderful Shabbos.